Good morning, everyone. Here are the Sanibel Island and Southwest Florida updates as of January 3rd, 2023. The Sanibel City Council canceled their weekly Facebook Live session again this week. That is two weeks in a row. The next session is scheduled for January 10th. The Mayor Holly Smith posted her weekly mayoral proclamations. At this point, she signs and renews them weekly. I have covered them before. They are basically extending the state of emergency, the curfew, etc. The main differences this week is that the curfew proclamation was edited to remove the following line. To best ensure only those with a proper purpose are on the island, all individuals within the city of Sanibel's legal boundaries are required to have in their possession and produce on request a 2021 or 2022 Sanibel Hurricane Pass or a government-issued identification with a Sanibel address or otherwise be accompanied by an individual with such credentials. That line was stricken out. In other words, hurricane passes are no longer required to be on the island. They also amended the beach closure proclamation. It reads as follows. Based upon potentially dangerous storm-related debris on the beaches and in the waters adjacent to the beaches, all public beach parking within the city of Sanibel is closed to all those other than Sanibel residents. Additionally, Sanibel residents and all individuals are highly discouraged from accessing any public beaches or surrounding waters unless actively engaged in an organized cleanup effort authorized by the city. The city struck out the wording Sanibel residents. It was mentioned twice in that proclamation. In other words, Sanibel residents are allowed to walk the beach, which they have been anyway. On a side note, if you are staying on a hotel on Sanibel or Captiva that sits on the beach, yes, you can walk the beach area surrounding the hotel. Same goes for if you are renting a house or a condo on the beach. Yes, you can walk the beach area in front of the house you are renting. For the amending pool and spa dewatering regulation, the city added the line, to avoid prohibited runoff, the speed of dewatering shall be at a rate slow enough to allow all water to percolate down through the owner's property on which the pool or spa is being dewatered. Silt fences with sorbonnet booms or socks are recommended to help facilitate proper dewatering, end quote. If you are not familiar with what I am talking about, it is illegal to drain your pool if the water is going into your neighbor's yard or the city's storm drain system. This is an ongoing issue that I just shake my head at. If you are a pool owner, you should know how to clean your pool without flooding your neighbor's yard or backing up the storm drains. Common sense is apparently not common when it comes to pool maintenance. For anybody wanting to visit Sanibel but is intimidated by the, all the hate posted on social media with posters basically saying things like, stay away from Sanibel, it needs time to recover, they don't need looky-loos, blah, blah, blah. My best advice is don't read comments on social media. Form your own opinion. Sanibel is not a private island. It is open to the public. If you want to visit Sanibel, then visit. Just don't park illegally. Don't drive like an idiot and don't trespass on private property. Simple enough. Again, common sense. 95% of Sanibel residents are not hateful in person. Social media tends to bring out the worst in people, especially Facebook. Make your own decisions. Do not let strangers on the internet, internet decide your life. Let me read that again. Make your own decisions. Do not let strangers on the internet decide your life. And that's just my opinion because I don't want to get into it. But there's a lot of hate on the internet. People are not like that in real life. They're not. Trust me. Sanibel residents you meet in person are going to be perfectly nice 95% of the time. There's always the exception. But in my experience, Sanibel residents, well, at least the business owners, are very welcoming. Thanks for listening.